Hi there, I'm Johnny Michaels from Lab LV, and I'm going to make you a cocktail today, and we're going to use apéritif liqueur. Now, apéritifs are very bitter liqueurs. They're good for stimulating the appetite. They're not that popular here in America, but with the cocktail renaissance that's going on now, more and more people are going to discover them. Here's a couple of the most well-known apéritifs on the market today. This Campari over here is by far the most bitter. It's a love or hate kind of thing, and you kind of got to ease into this pool. So I don't recommend it all the time for the uninitiated. Aperol is made by the Campari company. And supposedly this one has got like flavors of rhubarb and orange. It's not quite as bitter, but it still has a nice bright flavor as my favorite. Pimm's is another traditional uh, bitter liqueur. It's English. To me, it's a little cough syrupy. It's not quite as bitter. It's not that I don't like it. I just like Aperol better. So today I'm gonna make you a drink using Aperol. I call this drink a pink elephant. The recipe for this margarita is not ounces, this, that, whatever, because everyone uses different sized glasses. So I'm gonna talk about percentages. And what we're gonna use is 40% tequila, 40% pink grapefruit juice, 20% Cointreau, which is a sweet orange liqueur, sort of a top shelf triple sec, and then 20% of the Aperol dash of orange bitters. We're gonna start off by rubbing a piece of citrus fruit on the outside rim of half a glass. Then we just roll that in the salt, and there's your salted rim. That way if people want salt, they've got it. If they don't, they don't have it, you know? If that's not enough salt for them, maybe you can just put out a salt lake at one of the tables and people can just hang out there. We fill in a glass with ice. I'm gonna squeeze in a piece of lime. I'm going to add my tequila, add a little bit of Cointreau, add a little bit of Aperol, add my fresh pink grapefruit juice, this little dash of orange bitters. Then I'm going to cap this. I'm using a two-piece shaker, you know. Make sure you have the metal part on the bottom. And when you seal it together, just give it a good little twist to make sure it's sealed tightly. Shake it for a bit. I got my hands on both halves so it can't come apart and spill all over me. You don't want that. Then you can just like twist it apart. Then I'll pour the entire contents into the glass. And then I like to garnish this drink with a piece of orange, key lime, that's called the pink elephant. You can get that in the lounge here at La Belle V. Or, now that you know the recipe, you can make it yourself and entertain your friends. Have a great summer. I'll see you next month.